Thanks for tuning into our podcast. We love having you here, and it's our mission to bring you all the latest and greatest tips, skills, and know-how to make you the best that you can be. We know that you have it in you, and we're going to show you how. Now, now, let's get started. This episode is powered by Poddex. Thank you for tuning in today. You are now listening to That Will Never Work podcast with your host, Maurice Chisholm. Thank you, thank you, thank you for tuning in today. Thank you for tuning in today. You know, the last episode we talked about success and trying to help, right? You know, uh, uh, the process. Well, one of the things I have noticed uh, in my journey and in my growth to get to where I am today and so I believe it's a hard thing to do and to have recognized uh, this idea and people normally do not understand it while you're on your journey as you're be- becoming more enlightened um, more educated more focused Uh, determined on your journey a lot of times what happens is that you outgrow your situation your friends your family and people do not understand what happened so I will explain to you a situation for myself Uh, there was a time where uh, as I was going through this process of growing the podcast and the business and things like that, uh, and because I was becoming more focused and grounded, <clears throat> excuse me, there were some things that I was no longer interested in. There were some things that, you know, did not um, float my boat, if you will. And I think what happens is those individuals that are part of that particular process do not understand that as you are growing and maturing and focusing and, and, and honing your skills and things like that, they don't understand that, you know, for some individuals, they get so focused on that, becoming better, that those other things that were not so important to them to begin with, in my case, is, is not important for me to continue on at this point because I have another journey that I'm um, on. And for some people that, that don't understand, um, you know, it's, it's okay for you not to be able to understand. But please also, as I stated in the up other episode, please support your friend, your family member, just because they don't have time for you at that particular moment, does not mean they're not going to come back. I think that's what gets lost at times, that you feel as though that individuals are leaving you, but they're not necessarily. They don't have to necessarily. It's just for that moment, they're on another page. They're surrounding themselves because keep in mind You know, as they say, birds of a feather flock together. So you have to keep in mind that as you are on your journey to grow, to expand, you know, you start to surround yourself with like minded individuals. So have you actually outgrown the people that you had in the past or is it just that your focus has changed? I no matter which way you, you, you spin it, understand that you are able to move on is up to that individual to catch up to uh, have a conversation with you to want to better themselves I don't want you to take on the responsibility to hold on to those individuals also you can't always take on a responsibility to carry individuals also because That can be very taxing to you, very stressful to you, especially if they do not have the same type of ambition and outlook that you have. 
one of the things that I believe that's difficult, and I'm again speaking from my own space, is you know, people may ask you, are you a sellout, or whether or not you are still with the uh, concerns or the questions that you were previously concerned about. I think what happens is that sometimes you could talk about things and you and you could stay in that one place. You could talk about it all day, every day. But what happens when you finally decide to get up and make a difference in that place that you felt difficult? Are you ready to make a difference today? Are you ready to uh, have a different outlook on life? How does that influence your individual friends, the group of friends, the the family members, uh, your co-workers? Once you start to get focused on certain situations, it appears that you might have outgrown them. Are you ready to accept that? Are you ready to accept that your circle has to change in most cases in order for you to grow? It's not easy. It's not simple. It can be a little scary in in an adulting task. But I believe that you're ready for that. I.e. while you listen to that will never work because all we're trying to do is motivate you to move forward in life. To have for you to to experience something different for you to not be afraid to take that step forward when it is time to do it. In the next coming episodes and when you have our content ready, you know, we're going to talk about how to to move forward and how to prepare yourself. But mentally, for some of us and the reason why I stay on these type of topics, because I get some feedback for it from individuals who need these motivational speeches and talks. Today might be your day where you might need to hear it. Are you ready to make a change? Are you ready for a a change of scenery? Are you ready for a change of conversation? Are you ready for that change of mindset? Are you ready to make that change in your heart? There are some things that that we need to, to focus in on as we continue to grow. And I can't say, hey, you need to focus on this or you need to focus on that because it changes for every individual person. But do you have that desire to make that change? Changing our friends is not easy. And we all know it's hard for you to change your family members. I mean, that's blood, right? (laughs) You know, but are you even ready to make that type of change where your cousin that you used to hang out with all the time that uh, does not understand and may say, hey, you are acting very differently than you were two or three months ago. Are you ready to hear that? Are you ready to deal with that? Keep in mind, you are strong enough to deal with it. You are ready for it. Sometimes some of us just don't want to hear it. So you shy away. So you you find a reason not to deal with it. I encourage you today to find what you want to do, where you want to go. Put yourself in that community and understand it might be time for you to outgrow your friends. Thank you very much for listening today. Loved what you've heard on this week's episode? Well, well, the answer is simple. It would mean the world to us if you could head over to iTunes and leave us a five-star review and feedback. Spreading the word really is the best way to grow our podcast and achieve even greater things. Thank you. Thank you.